This video is part of a Europe video series where we traveled through Europe with three young kids for three weeks. We traveled to five different countries. We spent time on planes, trains, and even 10 days on a cruise ship. Our kids were seven, five, and one for this particular trip. We went up the Eiffel Tower. We walked around inside the Colosseum and the Sistine Chapel. We even cruised down the canal in Venice in a private water taxi. This series will provide you with a glimpse into our vacation along with tips, advice, and details about our itinerary if you're thinking about making a similar trip. Hope you enjoy it and be sure to check out all the videos. So we've arrived here in Monte Rosa and the train station is right in the center of this town which is great. Very convenient. We don't have to climb up a mountain to get to it. See all the activity appears to be right here which we're gonna check out. What do you think huh? No. What happened? Oh, hey, hey, hey. So there was a big line, and then I went to pee, and then I went to heaven. Yeah, number two, two? No. Oh. One. But it was oh, heaven. It a while? Yeah, but it was heaven, and we played games like right for Big line? Yeah. Yeah, but we, but we were fun. Having fun. Uh, let's go while we have some good light. Can you see that? I know, I've been around there, stole his dog going away. The ladies were just like, oh my god, they're gonna catch the stroller. <laughs> you didn't see it going down the hill? Yeah. Oh, I almost lost Emma. Ah! Uh, I lost yeah. that thing. You know that long white thingy that goes on top? Yeah. It's pretty, right? It's pretty cool. You better buy it quick because it's gonna, uh, they're gonna close. Look at that, isn't that incredible? Wow! 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 Wow, wow isn't that incredible? Wow! Whoa! <laughs> Let's uh, try to make it across without getting wet, okay? Look at the water splashing up on here. Across here. Look at the water, it's wet. Hurry up. Watch me, water. Watch me. No, no, no. Look at that view, it's beautiful. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, waiting for it. Come on! I'm not scared! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm not scared. <laughs> Jenna, tell me something. You ready to go? <laughs> you've, you've seen all the villages along the Italian coast for the day? What do you think, Aiden? Watching them fish? Watch. He's gonna cast his line out. I know. I tried it before. Yeah. Fishing? Oh when did you God, go? Like, when did you go fishing? Um, Christmas. Oh yeah. You got that done. You got that done. It's kind of like. You got that done. Oh, the train, the train. Oh, look at that! Beautiful. Yeah, that was kind of easy, but like it was not. How cool is that train? You want to eat dinner by the hotel? Why? Because it's booty king. It's what? Beautiful. Booty time. Time to play. Time to take, time to play! Okay. And it literally smells disgusting. What's that? No, it's, no, it's, it's nice over there. It's just because of the storm right now. The storm, a lot of the mud. Booty, crazy. I'd imagine this in the Look summertime, when the water is calm, it'd be beautiful here. There's some huge waves crashing over there. Huge Ooh. waves. Ooh. And how cool is that train tunnel? I keep talking about tunnels, but there's tunnels everywhere. And how cool is that bell tower up there? Is that a bell tower or a clock tower? I don't know. It's beautiful. I think we're done here. I think we're done in Veranza. What is it? Where are we at? Vernassa. Vernassa. We're having a little ice cream. A little gelato. It's got graffiti on it. Yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. We're, we're taking a little break before we head back we to Monte Rosso. Mm -hmm. How's that uh, ice cream, Emma? Is it good? Mm -hmm. Just look up. Is it good? Look at my face. It's so good. <laughs> Did you enjoy your ice cream? <laughs> so you know, the thing that's surprisingly accurate these days, or my little tip, is that I remember 10 years ago when we were driving through Europe, you know, our cell phone, if we wanted a, a data plan for Europe, we had to pay like a significant price. Now, for example, T-Mobile, it includes it, and then I just paid a little bit of a premium to get like a 5G connection instead of like 3G or 4G point is, we're always relying, we're always talking about looking at the boards at these train stations. What you can always do is if you have data, if you have connection, for example, we want to go to Monte Rosso because that's where our hotel is at. 
So I typed in Monteroso and I hit directions. And if I hit the train option up here, it says that it's scheduled to leave at 6.34 and it's the Reg, it's a little blurry, but it's the Reg 12238 scheduled for departure at 6.34. And if I go over here to the board, it's 12238. So the point, the point is that if you have data, if you have a connection and you use Google Maps, it's amazing how technology is just so up to speed with everything you do. So that's the train we're waiting for. We're waiting for the 12238 scheduled to arrive in three minutes. And that goes with just about everywhere you travel in Europe. I did that when we were in Venice a couple days ago just to confirm that our train was on time and it was on time. I've done that a few other times and it's always updated within a few minutes. This one was actually updated 57 seconds ago, according to Google. Let me refresh it. Updated 52 seconds ago, 54 seconds ago. Stand back. Oh, stand back. Oh, Back in Monterosa, so. Are we gonna be closer to like the other one? Yeah. Yes! 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 yes. <laughs> you okay? Yes! Beautiful, huh? Beautiful. This is where we got. I know. Let's go, let's go. Mommy's not even down there yet. She's oh, still. Let's go, let's go. What are you excited about? Are you excited about dinner? So we're just finishing up our day. Just got off the train in Monterosso. Our hotel is just five minutes away. I've got another restaurant in mind that has really good reviews. It looks really good, so that's where we're heading. And uh, we had a fantastic day. We visited all five towns here in Cinquete. And uh, now we're going to go have a good dinner and relax. Right, this is one of my we did all of them. Yeah, that was a great day. Yeah, this is a really cool tunnel. We've walked through this tunnel three or four times now. Yeah. Well, the reason it is because it's cracked. The blue one is cool, but it's like a little tight. And yeah. I can feel like people. But just, this is like this like old. Yeah, and you can hear it. Yes. Yeah. 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 This one has a lot of like. Character, you know? And it has these little window cutouts every so often with yeah, history. There was one that was cracked I should scan one of those uh, QR codes. Which ones? These window has a QR code with like a, well, probably some history in that QR code. Hey, did you left them up? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you got scared, huh? <laughs> you got scared. <laughs> Emma, 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 you see that your brother almost left you. He almost left you. Emma, all the way down here. Run away. Emma's been rolling. The runaway baby. Runaway baby. It turns on its own. It's turning on its own. Yes. Oh, so here we are. Outside the tunnel. Back into Monterosso. Just on the other side of the bridge. It looks so yeah, I like that one. Yeah, I went after you. What? She wants the bread. Uh, yeah. yeah no. She didn't like in the bread. We found a restaurant to do that. But the first one we wanted to go to was already full with reservations. 
So this one looks really good too. They snuck us in the back. No, there's no place for you right there. You okay, Eden? Daddy, can I have a pillow? Team mobile. But you gotta sit, put it back here. How does it feel? No. So, so good. You like the pesto? So, so, way. Like no, like I love mom. I, I like seafood pasta way more. <laughs> Like, oh, like, you like, it? like a hundred at it. Did you like the food? Did you, Did you like the food? Yes. Back to my game. Daddy. You like the cake? Daddy. Yeah. So like the pesto pasta was like a hundred out of fifty. Mm -hmm. This was a hundred out of hundred. Wow. So I know I said this yesterday and it's definitely true. When the cruise ship crowd and the day tour crowd thin out in the evenings, it's really cool. And it's cool because it's just not congested. There's so much, uh, so much to see, and there's so many places to explore. Going up these stairs. Oh my god! All right, so this is the last flight of stairs for the day. Last? No, honey. I think we're gonna take him out though when she gets to the top. This is what we've been doing the whole time. You got it? I don't think so. <laughs> She's falling behind. You gotta catch up. <laughs> oh. oh my god. It's so heavy. You gonna get a drink, really? Yeah. We're back at the hotel room, taking it easy, relaxing. Kind of looks like I've got a green screen behind me, but it's just the uh, headboard here of the bed. Yeah, and, um, and I'm playing cool shit. <laughs> yes, yeah. And I'm these playing. kids are having way too much fun with their bunk beds. This is yes. a great hotel for families. They have two accommodations, two rooms that can accommodate like five or six. I think five. I mean, if you consider we have five, we have like a two singles put together. So that's like a, a full or a queen size mattress. And then we've got the crib over there for Emma. Emma. And then we've got the bunk beds for Aiden and Ethan. So we're very comfortable. Yeah, and we're, Aiden and me are sleeping together. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, and they won't sleep separately. They want to sleep together on the top bunk. So that leaves an extra bed below. But anyways, we're, uh, okay. we're gonna just have a cocktail. Erica has gone down to the bar to get a drink. We're gonna have a cocktail. We're gonna relax. It's only nine o'clock, but we're gonna take it easy because then we've got a uh, we've got a train. No, okay. even don't play with that ladder, okay? Not with Emma right there. They're taking the ladder up and down. Um, so we've got an early train tomorrow, I believe, at nine o'clock. We're heading to Pisa. The plan is to head to Rome tomorrow, um, where we're gonna catch the cruise the following day, but. We, um, I rented a locker in advance, so we're gonna arrive to Pisa. We're gonna stow our bags in a locker, which is a, supposed to be right outside the train station for four or five hours, and then we're gonna go to Pisa and uh, go do go look at the Leaning Tower, and uh, that should be fun. So we're gonna check it out. So, anyways, we're off to bed. Talk to you soon. See you tomorrow. Good night, Emma. Say good night. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Arrivederci.